Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what is at the rate cucumber options annotation in test runner class? And list down the list of properties that at the rate cucumber options can be specified with. Let me answer. First of all, at the rate cucumber options annotation can be provided in the Cucumbers project in test runner class. Okay. And uh, the reason for providing this at the rate Cucumber options in the test runner class of Cucumber project is to specify different properties. Okay. To apply different properties to the project and all. So while running, if you want different things to happen, for example, if you want a particular report to be generated, okay, if you want to connect the future files with the uh, step definitions, okay. And uh, if you want to change uh, the kind of uh, text or output that is being displayed in the output console of the Eclipse ID or whatever it is, we can specify these different properties in the at the rate Cucumber options. So what are those different properties we have in the, or we can specify in the at the rate Cucumber options. They are nothing but features, glue, tags, plugin, dry run, monochrome, strict name. These are few different properties that we can specify in the at the rate Cucumber options in the test runner class of the Cucumber project. Let me explain the properties for you one by one. First property is features where you provide the location where in the project where exactly the feature files are available. Let me show you practically also for that I'll switch here. You see this is a Cucumber framework or Cucumber project and uh, I have opened this test runner class. Let me open it again. Here under the runner package, I created the test runner in this framework. Open that. In this test runner class, okay, I can use this test runner class to run all the feature files here. Okay, run as a JNI test and it will run all the feature files. But how can this test runner locate all the feature files in this particular project? Because in this Cucumber options annotations, we have provided a property known as features property to which I have provided the location where exactly in this project, the feature files are available. The feature files in this project are av av available under SRC test resources under the features folder, okay? So this is the location. So features property is generally specified in the rate Cucumber options of test runner class of Cucumber project to specify the location where exactly in the project, the feature files are available. The next one is glue. The next one is glue where So similarly, we have one more uh, property that we can specify in the at the rate Cucumber options that is glue, where we can provide the location of the step definition files and the hooks. Okay, so here to this glue, we can uh, specify the location where the step definition files, you see, just give the package name under with the step definition files, where the steps in this particular feature files are implemented, that uh, package name you can provide and also the hooks, okay, wherever you have these hooks created like uh, at the rate before, at the rate after hooks, okay. This method hooks, wherever you created, right, that that package name also you can provide, okay. That means you are connecting these features with this glue. So these are these two properties and apart from that, we have tags. If you provide these tags, uh, like for example, uh, here in this login.feature file, this particular scenario has the at the rate login tag. So if you specify here, like tags is equal to, and you provide the name of the tag, like at the rate login or something, only the, only the scenarios, okay, which are specified with at the rate login tag name will be running. Okay. That is the purpose of the tags. We can specify the scenarios. So if you want to run a particular set of category of scenarios, okay, which are specified with a particular tag, like smoke, sanity, regression, okay login register whatever it is that tag name if you provide only that scenarios related to that specified tag name will be running instead of all the scenarios in the project then plugin plugin is a place where you can provide different uh, cucumber plugins we have plugins uh, to generate the reports and to perform different actions okay for example here we have a plugin known as uh, this H, uh, this uh, cucumber report okay this plugin if you specify as a value of this plugin uh, then this will generate you the Cucumber report, okay? 
and you have specified the location okay under the target under the target under the cucumber reports folder okay a cucumber report got generated html cucumber report got generated this is with the help of this plugin along with that pretty and all it will uh, make the things uh, prettier in the output console and all like that multiple plugins are there that you can specify in the plugin property then dry run so before running your automation scripts if you uh, if you specify this dry, dry run in the cucumber options and uh, turn it to true okay if you specify like a dry run like this dry run is equal to true like this if you specify before actually running any of this automation script that you have written inside the step definition files of this feature files and all before any script runs it will check whether each and every step in the scenarios of the feature files are implemented or not or if there are any, if there are any particular steps in this uh, scenarios of the feature file which are not implemented then dry run will uh, specify that in the output console it will display that particular step out of all the steps in the scenarios of the feature file in a different color like a orange color so that with the help of dry run you can find out before running the actual scripts you can find out whether all the steps in all the feature files of this project are implemented or not or implemented as part of the step definitions or not okay that's the purpose of the dry run then we have monochrome so it makes the console output more readable okay if you are getting an improper output uh, in the output console when you run the scripts in the eclipse id output console here then to get a proper output you can mention this monochrome property then we have strict so it will fail if any particular step is undefined or pending okay if you have not implemented well dry run will just mention that a particular step is not implemented but strict if you provide it will directly fail okay cucumber will treat undefined and pending steps as failure they will fail the test that's what is a strict property then name it provides a name for cucumber test suit okay whatever the scenarios that got run right uh, so they they will be uh, run under this test suit and uh, the test suit will have a particular name that you have provided here with the help of name okay if you specify this name in the cucumber options so that cucumber test suit that you have run a name will be provided okay so hope guys you understood uh, what are cucumber options what is the purpose of specifying this cucumber options in test runner class of the cucumber projects and what are the different uh, properties that we can specify in this cucumber options and what what uh, does each and every property in this cucumber options will do in this session okay so that's all for this session thank you bye bye